Hey everybody, welcome back to the vlog. What's up guys? Um, I feel like I'm literally always starting my vlogs in my room like this, but that's okay. Welcome to this summer night. I'm so excited for this video. I feel like summer afternoon slash nights are like the best. Right now it is 220, just changed to 222, 222. We are now in the afternoon and we're gonna have a good rest of our day. It is super hot out right now. It's it's 81, but it's like full sun and there's no wind. I've just been laying outside for like an hour and I'm probably gonna go back outside for a little bit. Something that I really like to do, it's kind of weird, but whenever like I have to wash my hair, I like to have my sheets like clean too, just cause then I feel like extra clean because I have my hair washed and then my sheet washed. I don't know if that's like super weird or not, but I just like to have clean sheets when I wash my hair and my hair is so crunchy and dirty right now. I should have washed it like two days ago, but I just kept doing slick back looks because I didn't feel like washing my sheets. So now I'm gonna wash my sheets and then tonight I'm gonna wash my hair in my shower which I feel like is gonna be such a great shower because it's like after the sun, it's just gonna feel so good. So yeah, I'm gonna wash my sheets right now and then we're probably gonna head back outside. I need to start a new book because I just finished mine. We'll probably have to pick that out as well. I wish I lived by the ocean or some kind of body of water. All we have is a river and it's dirty and gross and it's freezing. So you can't just like take a little swim in there. It'd be so nice to just like take a little dip right now because it's so hot. I'm like, let's pick out a new book first. I think I want to choose from one of these here on my desk. If you guys watched my last video, you know I just read this book by Abby Jimenez. Oh, I, I also just finished, I just finished Summer Romance by Annabelle Monaghan. That was pretty good. Um, it was really short. It was like... 300 pages but i have been in a romance mood which i normally am not in like i don't really read romance books i mostly read like ya fantasy i'm gonna be honest i don't know but i've been in a romance mood so i think i want to start the happily ever after playlist by abby jimenez i also have no idea what this is about it's like 360 pages we'll start this book I don't really know if this is a good book or not, but we'll just try it out anyways. Cause I, I did like her writing, I just didn't like her character in the last book. I'm gonna do my laundry and then I don't know what else we're gonna get into. I feel like every vlog I do has like a montage of me making my bed or unmaking my bed, but whatever. Let's go put this in the wash. I just hung up my clothes on the clothesline and I don't know there's just like something very not like nostalgic but like I don't know it's just so fun to hang up your clothes on the clothesline I've been doing it um, kind of since it got nice outside um, my my mom bought some clothes pins so I can hang up my laundry and I've been pretty much every time I've done my sheets I've hung them up outside at least 
um because i don't know there's just it's like a smell and like a feel when you when you know they're dry and you go and grab them from the clothesline outside in the late afternoon there's just something to it that just feels so nice and obviously i can't do this all year because half the year is like snowy so i want to take advantage of it for as long as i can um i put on this outfit i put on this outfit for no reason I'll show you this is the outfit um the skirt is drift avenue um it's just this nice knitted material and i love it and then this shirt is i got it a few years ago at free people so i don't know if they still have it or not but it looks like it's like inside out because the stitching's on the outside but i don't know i like it a lot and it's cute with this skirt i want to go do something maybe one of my sisters will go do something with me i don't know maybe we should go on a walk maybe one of my sisters will go on a walk by the river we'll see I'm not going to the river because honestly the river is kind of sketchy when you're by yourself in my personal opinion so I live kind of close to a park so I'm just gonna go take a little walk in there it's kind of downhill and then you have to go back uphill it's a little twirly so we're just gonna do that before I eat dinner so let's go on a little hot girl walk I honestly I haven't gone on a walk like this since we had our puppy and it was so fun but it's always super awkward walking by yourself in my opinion i don't know why it just feels weird going on a walk by yourself without like a dog but i'm getting over that fear right now and we're going on a walk i am gonna have my headphones in i'll be aware of my surroundings let's go on a little walk i'm excited road and there's like a dirt road but I don't know where it leads to I don't know if it's like private property but I kind of want to go up it so I just want to see where it leads well it was a dead end that was a fail that's okay now I know but yeah now I'm just gonna go back to the main road I guess because there is nothing else out here besides dirt road and the dead end. I also wanted to mention, I do not, well obviously I just said I don't take walks like this. So I obviously don't do this every day. <laughs> Cause I usually just go to the gym, but I didn't go to the gym today. So I thought I should at least get some kind of exercise. So that is why we are taking this walk. <laughs> that was probably so pointless of a clip, but whatever. food um it's right here i just made like a little taco bowl thing <laughs> and then i also have a piece of dill sour bread toast with some butter on it um that my mom made and i'm gonna eat this because i'm starving i feel like i've not eaten very much today and that's not good and then 
I gotta shower because I am stinky. Thank you. Every three minutes for optimal cut. so bad <laughs> let's oh let's take my hair out let's see what this thing looks like oh okay so oh my goodness that is nasty okay I'm gonna try and brush through this That's still pretty bad, but at least we're washing it tonight. So let's hop in the shower. I already brushed my teeth because I like to brush my teeth before I like wash my face and stuff. And it's just easier if I do it before I take a shower. So let's get in the shower. Honestly, that happens like every single time I wash my hair. I wash it like I try twice a week. Let's continue on with the little night routine I have. First, I scrub my face with my oil cleanser. I do this like when my face is like kind of dry. I don't know why. I think it cleans my pores pretty good. I'll do a few squirts of that. And then I will just scrub it on my face for like two minutes like a very long time that's why i usually like play something because i get bored but i try to get like everywhere that i would have like pores okay i'm gonna call that good but while that's still on i'm gonna go in with this oat cleansing balm and do the same thing i don't know if this step's really necessary but this oat cleansing balm just like really makes my face feel clean because it has like little dots in it that kind of exfoliate your face but don't like it's not harsh or anything so this just like really makes my face feel so clean so i'm gonna scrub this in too just like that i really like to emphasize the places that i'm freaking out like i have a little pimple right here and right here and right here to really screw up those spots okay now we're gonna wash it off after we wash this off, I'm going to go straight in with this just regular cleanser. I'm just going to do this all in one little to go. And I'm also still wearing my towel because I get so messy when I do this. Water gets everywhere and I don't want my pajamas to be wet. So. Okay. 
Okay. My face is clean. Okay, I know I just put on lotion in the shower, but I like to go in and put on this Hawaiian Tropics Hawaiian Tropic after sun lotion everywhere just because I did get sun today and I feel like this just like makes it stick and it smells it smells really good. So I'm gonna put this all over. This is like the best feeling ever. I'm clean. I made my bed, it's clean, and I can just lay down in it, and everything is clean, and I'm so happy about it. I think I'm gonna read. That's what I'm up for right now. And I do have to wake up early for work, but we're still gonna read a bit, so let's read. go to bed um i usually set my alarm for like 3 45 and snooze it a couple times and then i get up for work thank you for joining me on this evening it's been fun it's been a good one um nice hot day i got a little little sun kiss so that's good but yeah okay bye guys ah.